obviously, you know, he's um, a pretty tough way to finish the game, but you know, it's been four in the final quarter. What, what do you think that down to? Yeah, I think, I mean, the whole game was a grind, right? It was two teams battling for form. Um, you know, you saw that primarily in the first half where it was like momentum swings to and fro, but um, Adelaide were the ones to find form. And for us, it's just, you know, we're just really struggling to score. Jason, Stephen, do you have another question? Uh, Adam, uh, with that, um, the run that Adelaide went on in the third and fourth quarter, was, is it the balance halfway through the third term with one point difference and then uh, they just really blew away? Was that more about you or more about them, the way that the game sort of went in that last quarter and a half? Yeah, no, it's, it's definitely about us. Um, you know, um, the things obviously that, you know, we're, we're trying to build on. Um, and there's things I've talked about before we were making steady progressions on. Um, it's hard to stay focused on that, right, when you're also now dealing with the disappointment of uh, of a loss like that. We've had that infliction all season where we just we dry up for spells and our own ability to score. And, you know, sometimes it's the offence. You know, we went deep into the playbook today, um, just trying different things. Um, Sometimes it's the, the little things where you're trying to hit on screens and then sometimes it's just missing layups and missing wide open shots. And so it's like that trinity of like just just bad basketball that, you know, um, is more than most of our games we've had quarters of that. Um, and you saw it probably at its worst tonight. And uh, Taj, where did you feel it went wrong for you guys in that? Did, I mean, Adam touched on there. Did you tend, you'd agree with that, I'm assuming, but just the way that it sort of fell apart, the way that Adam described? Uh, yeah. I mean, honestly, it's just, I mean, Coach has done everything possible for us to be better. And, I mean, just looking at it like everybody didn't play good. So it's, it's hard. It's hard to do anything when no one really has, besides maybe Keanu, no one played good basketball. Uh, we just, I don't know, we just got to be better. Coach has done so much to try to make us, put us in positions to make the game easier. And we just, we just not doing it right now. Uh, we just not doing it. And Adam, uh, with uh, Scotty Machado, no points on none of 12, I don't think we've probably ever seen him do that. He probably won't ever do it again. Was that, is that a reflection of the, fo the form that he's in? It's been a bit inconsistent. Obviously, he's had the injury as well this season. Or was it just one of those nights where it just didn't go for him? Um, yeah, look, obviously, it's it's been a rough patch for him. Um, and again, another, another you know, we're, we're trying to get him going. Um, you know, his disappointment obviously is is outweighed by anybody else's disappointment and he feels it. Um, we can just sort of, I guess, um, like, you know, my brother, he hits me up all the time with things about, you know, just, um, you know, staying positive and, and, and the lessons you learn from this. And there are lessons, right? Like, it's only a loss if you, you know, if you don't learn anything from it. <laughs> we're doing a lot of learning this year. Um, and a lot of that was obviously also, you know, how you handle disappointment, you know, it really tests your character. Um, so how we handle this disappointment along a few other, um, you know, things that we, uh, we feel like we've let ourselves down on, and this would just be another one of those. My apologies, I don't want to crash as soon as I ask a question before. Uh, uh, is there an issue with the injury? Um, was tonight a, a mental thing, or is there a physical side to it as well? Does it still feel like a bit of pain from that injury? Um, uh, uh, you know, like I don't want to comment too much on it. It's 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 definitely a, a combination of um, form and injury and and coming back and um, you know us trying to integrate him into. The offense or in, into the sets where we can look to get opportunities for him to score. Um, that's pretty much where it sits. Thanks, Adam. Thanks, Stephen.
we've got the battle ahead of this weekend. Uh, Brisbane had their own struggles this season, and a few key guys out, notably Nathan Sobey, and you guys do have a, a reasonably favourable record against the board. Do you see this as an opportunity to, to atone for tonight and turn things around quickly? I think every game, uh, for at least definitely um, since we got out of that COVID break, I think every game we've been trying to atone for uh, our previous game. So, yeah, this will probably be no different. And, and again, like, you know, there's guys that are disappointed and now we sort of have to reflect and, 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 and learn from it and, and try and grow. But, you know, it's harder each week. You know, we're, we're not trying to sugarcoat it. There's, there's guys that are, you know, <laughs> not happy with the fact that we scored 18 points and a half. So, um, quick turnaround, we'll see what happens. Thanks, Coach. Good luck on Sunday. Thank you. Thank you. Appreciate you. No more questions? Thank you, guys. Thank you. Thank you. Appreciate, Appreciate it. it.